welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please subscribe down below and turn on your notifications so you know when a new video is posted. And I wanted to tell you guys to find me on Snapchat. A lot of you still haven't found me on Snapchat. And if you follow me on Snapchat, you see more of what we do throughout the day. You see more body progress and stuff like that. And plus you guys can message me if you guys ever have any questions or if I have any questions for you guys, that's a place where you guys can respond. But today I am going to be showing you guys what I do for my meal prep juicing. Because this week I have decided to eat pretty much raw this week and here's why. I have been sick for the last, I want to say three months, or three months, not three months you guys, I've been sick for the last three weeks and I just, I'm over it, I want to kill this thing and get rid of it and so usually I do this when I just want to kind of detox my body and jump on a healthy start and I, another reason in my case is I want to start meal prepping um, pretty hardcore and everything and so I want to do a nice little cleanse of my body and this usually helps me. It's just fruits and vegetables and this will have me feeling really great by the end of the week and then hopefully next week I'll be able to um, really start my meal prepping. And so this is what I'm going to be putting into my juices today. I have carrots. And apples let me see if I can get this to focus more for you guys there we go so carrots and apples and this is usually my main staple before whatever juice I have so if you don't have anything else in the fridge you should just definitely make sure you have those and I don't go out and I don't shop for anything specific when I am juicing I use whatever is in my refrigerator at the moment so we have the carrots, apples, and little cuties, or little tangerines here. And I usually use grapefruit, but I'm just going to go ahead and use these instead. So I have pineapple here, and then I have some ginger. And then coming over here, I have some celery. And then from the far left, spinach, arugula, and some kale. And then there's a lime there as well. And I got all of these jars. I believe I got them on Black Friday. And here is the juicer I will be using. This is probably one of the best gifts that Robbie has ever gotten me because I seriously use it all the time and it's so easy to put together. So the first juice I'm going to be putting together is one that I absolutely love to put together because it is so anti-inflammatory and it really helps me feeling well, especially when I have lupus and stuff like that. And so all I do is take some carrots and an apple and some ginger here, usually one or two ginger pieces, and then I put some turmeric in at the very end and that's what gives it that anti-inflammatory kick. And so we're gonna go ahead and make all of the anti-inflammatory juices right now. juice with the ginger and the turmeric is actually something that Olivia really loves to drink too and so it's great to make for your kids if you want them to start drinking a juice that's a little bit healthier as well. The next juice I'm going to make is usually called my fat burner juice and that's because I usually use grapefruit instead of these and so if you would like to make a juice that is more fat burning switch out the tangerines in this recipe and just use the grapefruit instead. It really, really does a great job. And so for this recipe, it's, it's almost the same. You're just gonna do carrots and throw in the tangerines and then some ginger. of a, a vitamin C boost than a fat burning juice but it's still going to be very beneficial. I'm going to 
gonna go ahead and I'm gonna move on to my green juices and pretty much I'm just gonna use whatever is left here and that is the celery and the pineapple and the apples, the lime and the kale, arugula and the spinach. And before I start, I'm actually gonna cut up the lime just so I have enough for each drink. If you guys haven't tried the apples and ginger combination, you have to. It's a must. It is so delicious, you guys. And this is actually what got me pretty much addicted to juicing was because I tried the apples and I just threw in the ginger and they just paired really well together. And so I was pretty much addicted then. And then it really helped me cut out my sugar cravings because I'm a huge sweets girl and I absolutely have to have desserts or some type of treat. So whenever I'm trying to curb that appetite, I just throw in the juices and that really seems to help me. And here is what they look like when they are all done. You just put them in the refrigerator and you can just shake them up as soon as you're ready to drink one. I don't like to make the juices too far in advance because I really like my juices fresh. So this would probably last me about two days maybe. And what I try to do is have two juices a day. Um, but it's really up to you guys, whatever you guys want to do. I try to have two a day, either a green one mixed with an orange one. So I would highly recommend this to any working mama out there who wants to feel like they're, they're putting something healthy into their body or anybody that just hasn't been feeling well, has a chronic disease or anything because these are all anti-inflammatory and they will make you feel so, so much better. And so I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. This is a part of me getting my post baby body back. And so stay tuned for more health videos. If you guys would like to see anything else, just comment down below or leave me a message on any of my social media accounts. I will be talking to you guys shortly and I hope you guys have a beautiful rest of your day. Bye.